Today we are in the anatomy lab. We are going to explain the anatomy table, which is a high-tech device. This device is used instead of the real-sized cannabar that is used usually in the anatomy labs of the medicine schools. As you can see behind me, there are also models beside the table because you want the student to see both of them, the real size and also the models. Here, today I'll explain some of the features that this table has and the students can take a lot of advantage from it. As you can see, I'll show you from the gross anatomy options. We have different uh, models, the Caucasian, Asian for female and male also. Here I have opened the Asian male body. Right now, this is the real size that we see. And it can be treated as a normal caravan. I'll make an incision here to show you that we can have it from sight. As you can see here, this is this layer you see is 2D. We have the option to look at from different angles of the same body on side, which is the top view. This is the side and we have it from the top view. We will work on this. As you can see, this is a 2D. Uh, it's true that I made an incision, but I can always go back to the layers before. So it will show me all the layers in details of what I have. And if I needed extra details, I can always add it. As you can see, it shows me all the blood vessels even the capillaries. Another option that we have with this device is to take high resolution samples of the different systems of the body or different organs even. This table is used for the histology slides as well beside the main anatomy purpose. Here it has separated all the systems in different categories and in each category it gives us the option to look through the slides that are related to that system for example here I have the brain and I want to take a sample and open it so even if the student does not have access to the slides here you can zoom in and go as much as you want into the details this can be treated as a normal slide Thank you for being with us today. Hopefully, we will cover more about this and the other labs in CAST. We will see you next time.